What have you heard about Nigerian men? Stereotypically, I've heard they cheat. I'm gonna be like, but. Okay. What have you heard about Nigerian men? Nigerian men. Yeah. Controlling. Let's start with that. Controlling. Ah! Yeah, man. If we investigate this, we better way. And why? I've dated a Nigerian man. Hey, what a surprise! And why do you say controlling? Because he was. So in what? In what? In what way? Um, he wanted to know when, where, what, how. Who with? Ah! I've heard that they can be selfish at times. Hey, wonderful. Shall never end. I actually just came out of an experience with a Nigerian man that suited me online. So what I'll say is a couple of things. In this situation, he was calling me every day. By the third day, by the second day, I'll say it was, "Baby, I love you." I don't know. I think they can dress pretty well. Ooh, okay. Yeah. So yes. like. Okay. Oh, you think so? Yeah, I think so. They can clean up real nice. <laughs> hey there. Subscribe to my channel. And also press this bell icon. What's going on, guys? You already know it's still your boy, M to the A to the C to the K A Y vibes. And I'm back again with another one. As you can see, it's nighttime. But we're out here at the mall asking women. What have you heard about Nigerian men? Are they aggressive? Are they controlling? Are they selfish? You know, let's find out from these women. Are they possessive? Because there's some women that think some African men or some Nigerian men are like that. But let's find out. Make sure you like, comment, share, subscribe, enjoy the video. <laughs> well, how are you? What, what, what do you think about Nigerian? What have you heard about Nigerian men? I actually just came out of an experience with a Nigerian man that suited me online. <laughs> So what I'll say is a couple of things. In this situation, he was calling me every day. By the third day, by the second day, I'll say, it was, baby, I love you. Hey! And I was like, you don't love me. So I immediately went with this nigga wants some money. And so I continued to entertain him because I was bored. Um, and I could see the that he had a, a, a nice lifestyle right. in Nigeria, okay. but I know the game. Period. So what's with the men, game? The game with men when they want to manipulate you to tell you that they I, I feel this way about you. Ooh. Right. And possessive when it came to where I was. First of all, you're all the way in Nigeria. Period. You can't control shit over here, what I got going on. Right. Um <laughs> Um, so he wanted to know where I was, who I was with. I was, you know, and I'm, I'm transparent. I'm over at a friend house. Is right. your friend a dude or a woman? He a dude, you know. Right. You know, and he didn't like me being around other men. Um, he, uh, yeah, he. But I was, he's back over there in Nigeria, so. So was it on Facebook or online? This or was, like this was Facebook. But, okay. but, but prior to this experience, I had always heard that. Just um, African men in general were possessive over their women. They want to know who, when, what, where, and why. Yeah, they're throwing them like that. Yeah. I would, I, I, you, you definitely right. Yeah, but yeah. not all of them are like that. Yeah, you know well, what I'm saying? but some, some are like that. Well, eventually the inevitable happened, right. and he said, "I'm hungry." <laughs> And I have nothing to eat. Now he involved his whole family. So he, he introduced his, me to his mama. Oh, you spoke to them on the phone? I spoke to his mama. He wanted to know about my children, but I didn't tell him anything about my kids. He just knew that I had kids. But he was like, Those are my kids, your kids are my kids. You know, it was like trying to play but, the mind right. game. If I was a weak, then Damn. I would have, you know, probably succumbed to his pressure or right. something like that. It, yeah, just. I love you too. I wouldn't been like. I, I thank you. You first. First, I was like, yeah, I don't. You don't know me. Right. You know? But, I would you love you, someone that you haven't seen. But, right. Damn. So. So what you did you? Say that a lot of people out here that love God, they ain't <laughs> never seen him. What have I heard about African men? Yeah. Um. I mean, like you're talking about stereotypes. Just answer the damn questions. Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. In general, though, about. And when it comes to relationships, you know. Yeah, I mean, I hear African men aren't really into African women. Like, they want to date outside their base when it comes to relationships. Um, I've heard that they can be selfish at times. Was that you? No. Was that you? I said no. Ah. I don't think none of that's true, but that's what I've heard. So. Have you dated one before? No. <laughs> and why? What? Um. 
I mean, I haven't have, have a boyfriend yet. I'm just oh, you a do. single woman. <laughs> I'm on okay. My own <laughs> okay. What about yourself? What have you What have you heard about African men? Just take Here's a listen to this. Um. Stereotypically, I've heard they cheat. Yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna be like, but. Okay. What else? I mean, at least to be honest. Like, I don't know. I think they can dress pretty well. Mm, okay. Yeah, yeah, so like. Okay. Yeah. Well. Oh, you think so? Yeah, I think so. They can clean up real nice. <laughs> <laughs> How do you know that though? Because I see them. I mean, they look, they look, be looking fine. Like, I don't know. Okay. You don't take that. <laughs> and have you dated one before? I have. And where was it from? In it was in high school. In high, so you don't remember where it was from? Where he was from? Right. Oh well, he was just from my neighborhood. No, I'm talking about like where, what, which country in Africa was he from? Oh. You don't remember? I don't know. No. Oh, okay. And how did it go with him? Like, how, how did it go? What do you mean? The, the relationship. It was dumb. It was just like high school. <laughs> it didn't last very long. I like your lipstick, by the way. Oh, thank you. <laughs> You're all good. So, the question of the day is: What have you heard about Nigerian men? Nothing. Jesus. <laughs> so. And why? Why? So you haven't dated any yet? No, I guess because it's not a common thing around here. You don't see too many Nigerian men. Really? So. Oh, for real? Yeah. I'm Nigerian. Yeah. So it's like, so you've never met any Africans at all? The ones that braid my hair. Oh, so I'm talking about African men. No. How? I don't know. Y'all don't I, be coming I'm, outside. I'm not like the first African man you like man that you've you've met. Yeah. Uh, you meet him right now? Yeah. Really? <laughs> That's kinda I, I I'm surprised. Yeah. <laughs> so you haven't heard anything about African men at all, Nigerian men, not at all? No. Ah You have any African friends though? No. Why? You don't like us? Yeah. I'm here. Yeah, I like everybody. <laughs> so I like why, everybody. So why don't you have any African friends? Do I don't know. Do you there are no to... Africans here. Well, yeah, some Africans do. Well, I haven't met them. What have you heard about Nigerian men? I not much. I, other than those little spam things people make, but other than that. Spam things like what? Like the spam people, like they fake to be Nigerian men, like uh, Nigerian prince. You're like, other than that, that's pretty much it. Like calling themselves Nigerian prince and all that? Yeah. So you think that's like fake? Yeah, they're usually fake. They're usually not even Nigerian. They're usually just white people. <laughs> so where do, you, where do you see that at? Where did you hear that from? Usually like on TV and like my like actual emails. Like, yeah. Oh. And yeah, so once the inevitable happened, I told him that I got four children that I'm taking care of. I can't take care of you too, boo. If you, it, you know, it, it ended with be, me basically not giving into what he wanted. So he eventually stopped. So did he ask for some money? Yeah, he did. Yeah, he's probably trying to scam you or something. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, a lot of them are yeah. like so that. that. So exactly. So I knew that this is what it was always about. about yeah. Right. yeah. We're single. Yeah, y'all do a hot girl summer? Is that what it is? Yeah, that's <laughs> all me. Independent women, like. But y'all are beautiful, right? And I know guys walk up to you guys all the time. Yeah. How do you do? You reject guys, or how do you just you just tell them no? I mean, I let them down nicely. Like, hey, I'm really working on. I mean, I'm working on myself. That's like an honest answer. Okay. Like, I'm not trying to be in a relationship right now. But like, when the time comes, then and I like him, then yeah, I'll just I'll go Damn. for it. What about yourself? Yeah. The same way. Same. So if yeah. guys walk up to you, just tell them no. I, I'm just not like interested right now. It don't matter who it is. It's just kind of like uh, I'm. Uh, yeah, I'm focusing on myself, my friends, like my friends. yeah, okay, so studies, studies. college. Yeah. yeah. Okay. So would you ever consider dating an African man again? Yeah, I like African men. Okay. Uh, <laughs> is that the only one you dated? No. Oh, you, That's you, you, I like Afri- you like African? I men. do. <laughs> and why is it? You want me to be honest? Yeah, be honest. Y'all come packing. <laughs> I knew you were going to say that. You're not the first place I say this. It's though. the truth. Yeah, I, I've okay. dated three African men, and all three of them, they daddy, bless them. Damn. So, thank, thank you. you. <laughs> yes. So, what about you? And they 
I've I've never had the experience, but I have definitely heard. And I wouldn't pass it up if the opportunity did come. Okay, okay. They're passionate. They're passionate, right? I'm glad you say that. I don't know if somebody ever told you if they rough, they're lying. They're passionate. They like to feed you and shit. All kind of shit. Let's say in the future, if an African guy walks up to you and is trying to date you, would you would you want to date one? One thousand percent, yeah. And why? Because, like, I mean, media portrays them as a certain way, but that's so not true. Like, I've had my dad as a role model, and yeah, I would love to okay. have that to have my what my parents have one day. Okay. So, would you date an African guy? Too? Oh yeah, definitely. And why? Well, just like. It just depends on the person, their character. It's so not about personality. Right. Like and when you know, you know. Like so it just yeah. So it doesn't matter where they're from. Right, okay. no, no. Well thank you very much and that's just the interview for today. Appreciate it. Hello guys, I hope you guys enjoyed that video. If you did, please be sure to like, comment, share, subscribe. We're on the road to ten thousand subscribers. So please let's make this happen. Let's get to this goal before the end of July. We can make this happen. Please share with family and friends. I know you guys enjoyed this video, so the more you share it, the more it gets out there. Thank you for the love and support. I'll see you on the next one. Peace.